The biggest bank fraud of all time has been exposed at France's second biggest bank, Société Générale. Hackers alert. An ITV News investigation reveals that your bank details are being sold on the internet for as little as a pound. Good evening. London's worst attack since the Second World War. Now it's the fraud which costs Britain £2 million a week. Every minute of every day, financial institutions around the globe face an ever-increasing and ever-changing threat posed by terrorism, money laundering and fraud. Norcom has been ahead of the market in understanding how this environment has been evolving and building a set of technologies that properly responds and allows global financial institutions to defend themselves. The financial crime challenge has changed dramatically over the last 20 years. We're seeing international organized criminal gangs. They are patient, they are managed, they have funds to invest. We have, you know, deployed our systems in more than 100 countries across four continents. And even today, we monitor for criminal activity more than, you know, somewhere between 1.5 and 2 billion uh, accounts worldwide. To meet their regulatory obligations, financial institutions need to have automated and dynamic detection and investigation tools. In the past, card fraud detection and management could take as long as 10 weeks. We've automated that process end to end, allowing institutions to both identify a greater number of compromises, regardless of the nature of the uh, attack itself, and to do so very rapidly, often being able to handle the entire process in a matter of hours compared to weeks. Software products profile and understand behaviors that are present in the financial networks, anticipating a pattern before a criminal activity has taken place. The second key area is a bit like artificial intelligence. It's another block of technology that takes that knowledge and allows you to actually watch transactions as they go through the network and to sense and to find suspicious behavior. Forensic investigators can look at suspicious behaviour as a single incident or as part of a pattern, allowing the bank to clean up and respond rapidly. You're able to see changes immediately and so you can adjust, increasing your controls, changing limits, basically managing the fraud. It puts senior management in a very powerful position. The NORCOM infrastructure has been developed in order to facilitate that process across all dimensions of fraud as well as dealing with anti-money laundering and anti-terrorist financing. Between 2006 and 7, UK plastic payment losses rose 25% to over £535 million. UK phishing attacks rose 200% in the first quarter of 2007 to 2008. And between 2005 and 2006, it was estimated that 15 million Americans were victims of ID theft. Norcom's technologies can reduce financial crime activities by up to 70%, saving multi-millions in operational losses. Their enterprise investigative management capability allows a business to take an enterprise view. So what Norcom does quite simply is to allow you to identify that somebody attacking you here is also attacking you in these other channels. When they come true, we're able to connect these to present them as one, um, as one threat. Now that has both a saving for the bank from a point of view of of, of mitigating that threat, but also from an investigative point of view. The result is greater productivity. Across different geographies, different product lines, more crime is monitored. NORCOM allows you to become a better guard dog, so you can clearly demonstrate to the regulators that you are risk focused and you are totally in compliance. By coming to NORCOM they can get a solution that will solve the regulatory requirements and actually get them a return of investment through combating fraud and real cash terms. Norcom Technologies, developing and delivering total solutions to fight financial crime.